The piston protrusion defines the distance between the piston and cylinder head. In diesel engines, the piston protrusion must always be checked if new pistons have been installed in the engine, parts on the crank mechanism have been modified, or if the face of the engine block has been reworked. A dial gauge with a measuring bridge is used for measurement. In the first step, it must be ensured that the engine can be rotated completely. In order to avoid measurement errors, the engine block surface must be clean and prepared for the cylinder head assembly. The engine is rotated in direction of rotation until the piston is in the top position. By means of the dial gauge, the exact top dead center of the piston is determined. This is recognizable by the change in direction of the dial gauge needle. After the top dead center has been determined, the dial gauge is set on the engine block surface with initial tension and the needle of the dial gauge is set to zero. In order to avoid a measurement error due to a tilting of the piston, the piston protrusion must always be measured in the direction of the piston pin axis. The piston protrusion can then be read off the dial gauge. In order to avoid geometric errors in the crank mechanism, measurements must always be taken on both sides of the piston. Attention! The protrusions of the individual pistons may vary. For this reason, the test must be performed for each piston. The measured piston protrusions must not exceed the maximum values of the manufacturer's specifications. If the piston protrusion is too large, the piston bumps against the cylinder head once it has reached operating temperature. This results in combustion errors and damage to the crank mechanism. Excessive piston protrusions can be corrected by means of cylinder head gaskets with appropriate thickness or pistons with reduced compression height. Pistons with reduced compression height can be found in our piston catalogue under the respective engine types. The measuring tools used here can be ordered from your local motor service partner. Further information is available directly from your local motor service partner or at www.ms-motor-service.com.